Let's take a look at sports here on The Breakfast Club on Robin Hood Radio. I think we can uh, start off uh, in uh, Major League Baseball, where the Rockies defeated the Mets 3-2, their third road win. Um, two hit. The Mets were two hit uh, through eight innings. Uh, so uh, the Mets uh, are uh, still in first place, um, but... Uh, it's a it's a it's a tight division. Let's put it that way. All right. Uh, in the National Hockey League, how about those Islanders? Um, they stunned the Pen- Penguins uh, three two in double overtime. They now take a three two series lead in that uh, in that series. Um, and uh, it was I think fifty one seconds into the second overtime. So uh, congratulations to the Islanders. Uh, if you're a Giants fan or a Jets fan and you want to watch football in person, uh, New Jersey has decided to allow full capacity at MetLife Stadium uh, for those games. So uh, they will be full houses once again um, for the 2021 uh, football season for the Giants and for the Jets. In other sports news, well... Well, we'll go back to Major League Baseball. The uh, Tampa Bay Rays won for the 10th time in a row. They downed the Blue Jays 14-8. to Now, the Yankees did not play. And I think the Red Sox also had the day off yesterday. I'm just scanning here. Yeah, that is that is the case indeed, indeed, indeed. Standings uh, look like this right now. Tampa Bay in the AL East is in first place. A half game over Boston and a game over the Yankees. But the Yankees uh, have two games in hand, which means if they win both those games, they're actually uh, tied with Tampa Bay. Uh, the Yankees are 8-2 and in their last 10. Tampa Bay is 10-0. and uh, The Red Sox are 7-3. and In the American League Central, the White Sox lead Cleveland by a game and a half. Kansas City next. uh, They're close to 500 now. They're four and a half games back. In the AL West, Oakland is the leader. Houston is a game back. And Seattle is five and a half games back. So that is is the uh, American League. Now as we switch over to the National League, the Mets lead the NL East by one game over Atlanta. The Mets are the only team above 500 in that division. Everybody else is below 500. Atlanta is second. Miami is third. Philadelphia fourth. And Washington in last place. And the National League Central, St. Louis, has a game and a half lead over the Cubbies. San Diego in the National League West, they lead the way, a half game over the Dodgers. But watch out, the Dodgers have won seven in a row. Uh, San Francisco is uh, next, a game and a half back. All right. In the NBA last night, game one, uh, and uh, the uh, Grizzlies beat the Jazz 112 to 109. Uh, the Bucks over the Heat, 132 to 98. Milwaukee leads that series two games to none. The Nuggets over the Trailblazers, 128 to 109. That series is tied one game apiece. Today, uh, the Celtics and the Nets will take to the court at 7:30. Uh, the Nets lead that series one game to none. So that is the NBA, and of course, like I said, the National Hockey League, the Islanders defeated the Penguins in double overtime yesterday, 3-2. We still have the Bruins off as they bombed uh, the Washington Senators, uh, the Washington, uh, out of the uh, playoffs very, very quickly. And uh, I think that's about it. Check on sports. I mean, you've got the normal hubbub uh, uh, going on about Aaron Rodgers and Julio Jones. He considers himself out at Atlanta. He announced that on TV yesterday. Everybody's taking advance, uh, advantage of Twitter and TV to make major announcements. I don't know. I don't know. 
Well, anyways, that is a check on sports this morning here on Robin Hood Radio.